A great Tuesday practice here in Tallahassee. Seminole fans, welcome out of the football practice field. I'm Scott Kodak for Seminoles.com. When we got to catch up with head coach Jimbo Fisher following Tuesday's practice, he was ecstatic about the way his team practiced. From fundamentals to drills, everything, his team was at the very best. He did have some news to pass along as Tyler Hunter will be the new punt returner starting in Saturday's game. He says he loved what he's seen from the sophomore from Valdosta. Tyler's a 4 3 guy. I mean, he had great, you saw him turn that interception the other day. Tyler's got great ball skills, and when I first recruited him, I saw him playing quarterback. They were running that option up at Lounge, and he was breaking touchdown runs. He was playing receiver and catching deep balls and running by people. Yes, he still has the explosion to do it. To do it. Yes, he does. Very good. He got great ball skills. Got tremendous ball skills. Catching, got good explosion. You saw him in that return last you know, the other day, and uh, he'll be back there first. It's easy to look at the stats and think that Chris Thompson is a great football player, but he's more than that. He's a leader both on and off the field. According to the running backs, they're playing for Chris the rest of the season. We're going to hold it out for Chris. I mean, CT4, we put it on our um, wristbands. We were going to hold this. We didn't know it was going to be a season injury. But um, now that we found out, we was like, look, we got to hold it down for him. And he came to practice today, smiling, um, right, getting everybody crunk today. He came to the meetings today with high spirits. And he's not one of those guys that's selfish, like, my season's over. I'm like, there's no need for me to come to practice or to the meetings no, anymore. He's out there still leading us and coaching us. We always looked at him as a coach. But I mean, it's, it's, it's definitely devastating. It's very devastating to be able to lose a leader like that. But I mean, we, we have great backs to be able to come in and fill the shoes. There's no question that when you look at defensive plays, Telvin Smith is around the ball on each and every play. When you talk to the Valdosta native, he said it's something that's bred in him from a young age. He loves playing with reckless abandon. I like to run around. I, I stay, uh, the phrase we use, I, I like to run around with my uh, head on fire. So, you know, I just like to run around and make plays. I, that, I just love the game, and I just play every, play hard every time I'm out there. I think it was just uh, bred in me from a young, from a young age, back on my um, little league team. You know, we used to, we was just taught to play hard, to love the game, to respect the game, and that's what I do. I love it, and I respect it every day I go out there. Make sure you stay with Seminoles.com for all the complete coverage as we get ready for the big Duke game on Saturday afternoon at 3.30. We'll have everything you want here on Seminoles.com. Full, complete interviews, photo galleries, plus much, much more from Florida State football. So on Tuesday evening, I'm Scott Kodak reporting for Seminoles.com.